Hello, it is Jay Foss back with a war video. It is Sunday morning. I've just woken up. Um, we are facing my former alliance, Wolves of the North, so it's an exciting one. Gypsy Danger has about five uh, players that used to play in that alliance, so hopefully can get a solid equalizer performance and uh, going in for hit number one. All right, so let's say decent amount of yellow. Um, I think I'll do it this way and play for the diamond. If I don't get it here, I don't want to mess around too much. Because um, I have a dragon over there that can get me to seven. Let's just take the dragon and then the other connection. So making this horizontal across the bottom will actually let's do it vertically and maybe kill Nolfod. Alright. Um we'll go this side. Maybe I get a diamond there. Nope, no diamond. So we're about to get equalized. Um, let's do the hit all. I would like to think here. I'll go and kill Zhang Fei, and then that gives you one more ghosted. And I'll go ahead and kill this side. Hopefully with the one extra tile, it should be enough. Oh, it was not. All right, he hit all. I gotta make sure that it doesn't get a background for Melia to do charge two. I'll go ahead and target there, get a blue connection to get some heals going. I had a yellow at the bottom there, I probably could have, should have took, but. <clears throat> um, let's see here. Well, there's, should charge failing at least. And we'll just keep working to get more yellow on the board. Uh, we'll take that directly. It's fine. Might set up a yellow, which it did. All right, he hit number one complete. All right, lining up for hit number two. Hopefully we get some yellow. And that's another decent board. Um, debating how I want to start this. I 
think I'll start. Hmm. I have at least two. There's probably three. I'm just take. It's taking a while for me to see it. Um. There's at least two. Let's go here to start. It probably wasn't correct looking at how it came up. Um. have the one yellow match that kind of breaks up a lot of potential combos down the road. Let's go... I do have another green. My board's just about to completely die here if I make this move, though. Let's try there once. So if I make the yellow vertical, yellow could come up. That's only one in five. Um, I mean, I kind of... It's one of those boards that look good, and I made a bad first move, and then the options sort of closed really fast. There's still a bunch of yellow, there's just not a lot of ways to connect it at this current moment. Let's go and take the damage into Panther. So I'm going to get hit with this once. Um, I'll go and take that to set up the yellow though. Alrighty, so I am going to get hit by a Lacey. I would like to go ahead and get the mana going. Let's see who she hits. That'll set up a dragon into yellows at least. Okay. We'll take that. Gets taunt more in sync with equalizer, which is great. I'm not sure this will kill Quinell. 84, that'll probably be just under. I'll just take the Lepus kill and then goes to yellow. I probably made that board a lot tougher than it needed to be, quite honestly. With the First move being incorrect. And an evade, that's okay. Should be minions should get there if not really close. All right, hit two complete. All right.
right, so hit number three it is. Going in. It's one of those where if Kill Hair revives three or four times, I'm gonna be in trouble. But. So not a lot of green, so I'm gonna need to do some decent clears. I kinda like the red diamond into the yellow match for a decent amount of clearing. Ren. Yeah, let's go ahead and pop it and see where we're at. So I think I will wait. I actually have two yellow. It's not like a traditional, but if I make this yellow at the bottom, then pop the purple dragon, I'll have uh, two yellow. I'll wait one turn on Garnet's heal. At some point, I'm going to need green. I can actually pop the diamond and get the same effect. There's revive number one. <laughs> That's how you get in trouble against kill hair. I'm about to be in big trouble. Okay, now I kind of have to kill this side over here. Um, or at least try to. I do have a green diamond. Might be a little bit late, though. Let me slash attack. So I'll get one slash attack here. I'm kind of out of red. I kind of have to take this and see where we're at. <clears throat> All right, we'll kill her. Go back to this side. Hit three done. That was that was. That kill her revive almost almost got me. All right, hit three done. Alright, going in for hit number four, trying a uh, Holda team. Um, Holda can be pretty tough if you get behind, but let's see how it goes. Normally I use Alfric with this, but with Equalizer I'm going to put Karnov in to get more uh, direct damage. Okay, we have a chance in a purple diamond, it puts green into Frigg, um, I think we'll try it once, and the luck continues here, um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and pop, I think Panther, Grimble, Karnov will come pretty close to killing the team here, so, if, uh, hold his minions, don't pop up. So we'll go Panther first. Grimble. Karnov. All right, hit four, done. All righty, going in for hit number five. My intent here is to uh, <laughs> copy this dude. So there, they, there's two hit alls here. I like to bring Loki to copy a hit all. So, going in for hit number five. So we have a blue diamond.
these are average speed heroes. Um, so I think I'll actually take the Lepus first and then I'll get back around to do the See, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, actually. Um, I'm looking at the diamond, looking to get multiple casts. And I kind of wonder if I should just pop it and then do the correct sequence. Um you know, get Frida up. Or alternatively, I could gamble and try to get a blue somewhere. If I make the red horizontal at the top, there's a chance a blue comes up. I could also make it at the bottom. I could make the yellow into the green. There's some combo possibilities there, but unlikely to set up blue. Um, if I were to pop it... I don't have a lot of my support colors going yet. The reason why I'm hesitating here is because I don't have the blue on the board to get Lepus back. And I don't want to mess this up because I'm in a good spot. Let's go ahead and cast. All right, we'll go Frida over here. And then we'll copy that guy. Now I got the backup yellows if it doesn't kill Diachan, which I did not. Um, 227, that's actually not going to kill her. So I kind of messed up there, to be honest. Uh, there's some possibility of blue here, and it's a decent combo, so... Yeah, that was a little bit of a misplay there. So... Still not super close to heels. Um, this is kind of a dead move. I want Lepus as a... Uh, hmm. Think here. I'm pretty not super close. If I get, I can get a yellow, but then Quinell and Luenia will fire. Um, let's just make this. They're going to fire anyway. All right, so... Yellow's the... Best chance, but like I said, if I hit, get hit with Quinell and Luenia, it's going to be really, really painful. The red is a decent clear, so it messes up the blue, but I need one of my heels. So now I'm in a bit of a situation. Um... Nolfod should live, so let's go there first and see who Quinell hits. Okay, that's probably the best case scenario, honestly. Um, so we'll go here, then the hit all. Oh, I forgot the... I just basically killed Frida by not healing first, but that's okay. Alright, I 
almost messed up a really easy board, but hit five, done. Alrighty, going in for my final hit here. And uh, this will be my third time using this team in war, so let's see how it goes. They're two for two, but it's one of my weaker teams, so let's get it. Okay, we have the support color diamond, which is not bad to start. Um, we have a decent amount of yellow. They're all sort of consolidated at the top again. I'm gonna need some decent size clears to bring up yellow to the middle, hopefully. Um, I'll go ahead and take the damage just in case I accidentally set it off. Still not getting any yellows, unfortunately. Guess we'll take the green and then heal. It should have a combo possibility. Hopefully yellow comes up. Okay, debating. I do have a yellow. Debating when I want to heal. kind of have to heal. I mean, I'm worried about the fiends. And I don't have a way to get back around to the heal. If I could set off Liz this turn and set off a yellow, that would be good. But... I'm not sure I'll be able to survive the hit all of Lepus and Liz. So it's kind of a tricky... Because if I combo into Liz accidentally, at the same time, I would like to enhance more than one green tile. Making the purple dragon sets up a yellow. Let's do that. Oh, I misread. Damn it. I'm making so many, that's why I don't usually hit on Sunday morning, making lots of mistakes, so. I'll go ahead and heal, I think that's the right play. Take the yellow now to get my fast heroes charged at least. But now I'm in with no green on the board at all. I'm in a lot of trouble here. Let's go ahead and take the tank out. I don't think. Yeah, there's no way with 1200, so. Debating. Yeah, 1600, that's not going to work. So I am going to lose in all likelihood.
so we have a lot of clear possibilities, but yeah, we're in, we're in trouble. This setting off the red combos into the blue. The green doesn't really benefit me at all, so we'll just clear and see who El Nadaha kills. Now, Phalene will probably kill two. I only have five green on the board. Take the yellow and see if we're at there. Okay, now I kind of have to that is six green. It's not enough for Ratatasker. left in quite a bind I don't think that those three green no there's no way with none of them are enhanced or anything there's no slash attacks on this turn um, but if I don't think I'm gonna be able to get to Ratatasker's heal so I'm going to pop and then pop the green next turn. Gonna be a couple turns late. Oh shit. Just get the damage, the healer's dead, so. Kill Lepus at least. Well, that was the very, very lucky. That's probably the luckiest war I've ever had. If I'm being completely honest. Um, between boards and... Yeah, that's probably the best set of boards I've ever had. So... They are at 16, or 31, you can see the scores. I will do a quick shout out to Wolves of the North, this is my former alliance. There's tons of great people here. And if you're looking to fight in the, I would say 20 to 35 range, for, you know, top 25 to 35 alliance, uh, I, would, I would definitely recommend looking at them. It's a great place to be. I have tons of friends here and they were the uh, first group to really give me a shot. So I'm glad that despite Sunday morning hits, I was able to get a really, really lucky set of boards against them. But um, whereas Gypsy Danger is around four or five. So that's why I'm there. But um, thanks for watching and uh, I'll catch you all next time.